Go. Hi, I'm Frank from Mesovich. I am uh, Sturge, Sturge from SFHA. And we're the starter at fucking hipsters. SFH is fucking yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, boys. Um, so you all have a new album. You're working on a new album, correct? Scott fucking hipsters. Yes. How's that coming? We're not working on it yet. No? We did two, year, we did two records within a year. Right. You uh, just had to told release. by everybody that you're not supposed to do that. <laughs> but I wanted to like move it along, you know what I'm saying? Like, we're gonna die soon. Let's like get two records out. <laughs> Let's be a real band, you know? Right. Well, um, it, you have a collaboration with the Slackers, right? That's coming up? Um, supposedly. It's been talked about. It'll probably oh. happen. I mean, so it's not been the worked drummer on yet? from the Slackers, mm -hmm. Ara, is also the drummer Left of a Crack, which is my other band, and, uh, right. and we're talking about doing some shows, so when we talk about doing anything, it means that we're in the same room together, and uh, Scott Fucking Hipsters is supposed to do a split with the Slackers, SFH and Slackers, and I'm fat, as far as Mike <laughs> says. But, you know, he's not great at getting back to you. I understand. Give him a call. Deal with he's a busy man. Time. Um, are you still producing music at all? Producing as in, like, Like other listening. people? I did that once. Oh, once? <laughs> with no cash. And, um, I mean, no, I produce, I've actually, I mean, I've co-produced every record that, every choking victim with the crack and... SFH record, but I wouldn't be considered the producer necessarily. Maybe I'm one or two of Rick Rubin. I'm not the Rick Rubin. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, I'm more the Steve Albini. So what is up with uh, Florida having flat crack? Flat crack? Yeah, it was, you might not remember. A long time ago in St. Pete, you were at a show. It was leftover crack. You were talking about or not you. Somebody. So I'm not Florida having flat crack. It doesn't have rocks in it or whatever. That's weird. No, I'm in Los Angeles, the crack it's um, it's like spaghetti. It's like it's like hard spaghetti. <laughs> like these guys spit it out of their mouths. Right. And it's like well, I'm Italian, so keep talking about it's spaghetti. It's a little spaghetti. It's not spaghetti. It's some what's a, what's what's a little bit wider than spaghetti. Oh, uh, fettuccine. It's there fettuccine. They must cure the crack in these things that are uh, fettuccine-esque. That's what the Italians say, right? Sure. Are you Italian? Yeah. 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 Um, right. well, I'm Sicilian now. Right. What are you, Calabrese? I'm just I'm uh, not. You're gonna, I'm you're regular gonna Italian. Killed by the Mafia. <laughs> I mean, I am Mafia. I'll he's kill Sicilian, you. though. He's, he's like... That's he's Southern. Like, he's I, only like, says, I only say that because it sounds cool, but I really am just like... Oh. <laughs> he's a top. Sicilian's <laughs> a top. No, they're not. Wait, nobody can see you saying that. <laughs> no. That, okay, uh, sorry. Sicilians, um, Denise says that Sicilians are the bottom of the mafia. Mafia That's people. Just so you know. They're going to come show you now once I publish this video. Views. Punk news views. Punk like, world views. Punk world Almost. views. It's confusing because there's like really world news. Right. All right, um, I'm sorry. So, and sorry, I know this isn't <laughs> regarding this band, but um, how do you feel on the whole, the Hellcat Records, when you all were doing the Shoot the Kids at School demo, and they wouldn't release it? Well, they released it, but they made us change the name of the record, and oh, okay. well, they are. And what did you think about that? Did it make you mad? It made me upset and angry. But did you mad, do anything about mad it? Mad in proper English. I'm not a dog. I was angry you and upset. You were perturbed. I was perturbed and angry and upset. Yeah. Great. It's called free speech and uh, Epitaph, you know, they had this history of being proponents of free speech and then they censored our record and kind of held us hostage under his contract for a couple of years. So it became, uh, became an issue. Well, Which, you're past it now, right? You're over it. Kind of, yeah. I mean, right now, I'm not, uh, I mean, I am over. I mean, personally, I'm over it. <laughs> the people involved, but I'm not over it because 
It might come up eventually again. Right. As an issue. Yeah, if that were to happen again, like you're on alternative tentacles, right? And that won't. It'll never happen. It'll again. never happen on there, right? Well, that's the thing about certain tentacles. They were like, you can, yeah, free speech is free speech. Just say what you want. They put out fuck world trade. Right. And, uh, well, you know, I got sent home, not sent home from work, but I had to take off. I have like a morning glory hoodie, the one with Jesus on it that says the whole world's watching. They made me take it off. Who did? Work. Work. <laughs> well, none, none of us. It was Casual like, Friday. You caught. Two, you, <laughs> I thought I could wear what I want. You got two of the uh, people that have never been in Morning Glory. Oh. Uh, but other, don't, there's, don't you know of all about them and no? I don't know that much. Ezra doesn't talk a lot. <laughs> gotcha. About his other band that never plays shows ever. Very true. All right. Um, think back your whole life and tell me the worst job that you've ever had. <laughs> Lift over crack. <laughs> <laughs> I really like dishwashing and I really liked being a busboy. But Lift where were you crack a dishwasher and busboy at? I was a busboy at um, a dishwasher busboy in Montana, and I was a. Uh, what do they call them? When we bring the beer to the runners? No, we bar back. Bar back, oh, yeah. Bar back at Wetlands in New York City. I like that job. That was cool. Do you live in New York now? I do. What's it like there? What do you do when you're not doing band stuff? Uh, I'm never not doing band stuff nowadays. My escape is Central America. Like where? I'm going to Costa Rica for the first time. In a week or so. You taking off? I got it. Yeah. I'll go crazy. All right. Um, let's see here. Uh, is there anything coming up? Are you all working on anything besides maybe the new album? Are you all doing more, planning more tours or anything? Well, the new album is scheduled for 2011. 2000, yeah. And the last record we did, Never Rest in Peace, we pretty much wrote and recorded it in like a month. So, uh, we figured we got to the end of the year to start working on it. Right. <laughs> <laughs> but besides that, we have, we're have going to Europe to tour, and we're going, I think, SFH mm -hmm. is going to Australia and New Zealand to tour in the, in the uh, whatever, the fall of 11. this hemisphere. <laughs> <laughs> because down there it's um, spring. Right, true. And so... Uh, you can't just call stuff full in the spring. At the end of the year, we're going to go, technically, we're talking about it. We, we already went, me and Frank, as leftover crack, so we're supposed to go as Starfuck Hamsters, which would be much better. Much More better. Fun, I think. Do you like this band better? I like everything. <laughs> stuff. Be honest. We need honesty. Um, I like... Left of a crack, and I like to start my answers. Better. Wah, wah. Better. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, um, do you think that having the word fucking in your band name, like, holds you back from doing oh, anything? not at all. What like, you don't get to play birthday parties and stuff? We can't do birthday parties, but we can play bar mitzvahs, apparently. <laughs> you like Jewish people? I am. I was... But I'm Jewish, but uh, that's my heritage. But I'm atheist, so I can't comment. Like, right, neutral. Yeah, well, I think a lot of New York City Jews are atheists, which is kind of cool for me mm -hmm. growing up. I don't know what I would have turned out to be as a <laughs> Christian rock band leader. MXPX? Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I just don't know. Alright, well, interview's about over, boys, so. Yeah. You can wave by unless you have anything else you want to comment on. Frank? Talk about Man a few words. That's a silly mafia. Anybody that watches this can get killed by Cecilia Mafia. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, it's been real. See ya.